What's up, Aries? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Aries, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying, just saying. This is How Do They Feel About You for November of 2021. Um, this could resonate if you have Aries in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Node, Midheim, or Jupiter. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only takes the messages that resonate. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just the best. If you um, would like to book a personal reading, it's $100 for 15 minutes. You have to text me. My number is in the description box below. Okay. This is the first time Aries. It can resonate if you have any aspects that Aries in your charts. And it's a free general reading. Okay. I'm feeling the consequences of my choices and actions upright. I've been um, telepathically communicating with you reversed. I'm so attracted to you. You don't know um, what you do to me. The butterfly reversed. Re relationship evolving reversed. Coffee cup reversed. Meeting and conversing reversed. Staring at you from across the room. Terrified to talk to you. Afraid someone will find out about the past. Oh my God. Woo. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh my God. Staring at you from across the room. Afraid to communicate with you because, um, of something to do with the past so somebody i'm afraid somebody will find out about the past possibly is what i'm thinking this person is um oh my god something happened in the past negatively with you and them or they're or maybe for some this could be third party or situationship energy for some i'm feeling for some it could just be something negative like a broken um like a breakup or a separation or divorce and um, they don't want to add fuel to a flame. But some I feel it might be third party or situationship energy. Um, incest energy for some. Mm, okay, incest energy for some. Okay, oh, yeah, okay, okay, yeah, we're moving on. Okay, so I'm feeling the consequences of my action. So um, that could be the incest energy for some. For some it could um, be a breakup energy or situationship or third party or some kind of negative something they've done to you um they're so afraid they're staring at you across the room and they don't they're afraid to communicate because uh, i think they don't want other people to find out about the past whatever that is incest or not i've been telepathically communicating with you reverse so i don't think they have players i don't think they have abilities or they haven't opened their third eye for uh, probability of um players or they don't want to telepath telepath i can't speak telepathically communicate with you however that resonates Oof. but there she are staring at you so i don't think it's that they don't want to telepathically communicate i think it's that they can't for some or they haven't opened up a third eye chakra enough to give themselves the probability to do it i think they live to i think they live too much in the 3d and they haven't really got in tune with their spirituality is what I'm feeling for some. I'm so attracted to you. You don't know what you do to me. So they're very, very, very attracted to you. For some, it's incest energy straight up. For some, it's not. For some, it's third party um, situationship uh, or um, just negative, conflictive, argument-esque energy, separation or divorce or breakup or what have you. But they are very, very attracted to you so much they stare, uh, stare at you across the room. Um, the butterfly, the relationship doesn't evolve because it was reversed. It's not evolving because they basically are just so afraid of someone finding out about the past, whatever the past is and however it plugs in for you. Coffee cut, meeting and conversing reverse. They're staring at you across the room. They're not speaking to you because it's something to do with the past. Um, however that resonates. Ooh, we. For some, it's a cousin. For some, it's a breakup. For some, it's an ex-spouse. 
Okay, I heard for some it's a cousin, for some it's a breakup, for some it's an ex-spouse. So you plug in your life however it fits. For some of you guys, it's a cousin. For some, it's a breakup. For some, it's an ex-spouse. And for some, it's a situationship. And for some, it's a situationship. So you plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Ooh, wee. That's, ooh, that's spicy. All right, I hope that helped. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices. If you think anyone else could benefit from the messages, please share the videos on your social media. I'd appreciate it. Love you guys. I'm staying.